Uh, that's right. Welcome back. We're live with your gunish coverage here at Alec Box Stadium for a new era, the Jay Johnson era. And team coverage, just Boucher alongside. You got to sit down go one-on-one -on -one with a guy that I think a lot of LSU fans don't know about, an Arizona kid who found out maybe he's a Louisiana boy. Yeah, Brian, and here tonight he will get his first start at LSU, but it won't be in the infield. He will be in a right field. How about that? I know, a little trickery from Jay Johnson already, but like you said, I caught up with the amazing All-American from Arizona, and he was definitely interesting to say the least. You come to Baton Rouge, you've never been in the state of Louisiana. What is going through your mind as you basically uproot your life and come here? Yeah, so I had never been to Louisiana, that is correct. Um, my dad actually played at ULL just down the road, but he had told me stories and on all these and these cool things that he got to go hunting and fishing and everything, and I'm sitting there like, okay, this sounds like a sounds like my place, you know? I, I can do a lot of those things. I enjoyed that stuff. I like being outdoors, but I was totally in shock when I got here. It's totally different than anything he had ever described, but I fell in love with it right away. I mean, I got to go hunting and fishing. I went crabbing, shrimping. I just, I love it, man. It's, it's an amazing place, and... I'm really looking forward to just all these people coming out and supporting. I mean, it's just it's really the true character of Louisiana and, and the true fans of LSU. Have you gone frogging yet? I have. I've caught in a couple frogs. Oh. I'm not very good, <laughs> but it is fun. I, I do like it. Your tweet when you announced that you were coming to LSU saying it's an opportunity to wear that iconic purple and gold. When you got to put on that purple and gold, what did that mean to you? One of the most well-known and well-recognized college baseball uniforms in the country. I mean, you can put that on, and anybody can tell you from tell you exactly what school that is. I mean, there's not too many schools that can say that, in my opinion. And, and I remember just growing up, and you always see LSU in the College World Series. And I remember going to Omaha when I was, I think, 12 or 13, and playing in a tournament in Omaha, Nebraska, and actually going and watching. And I remember Alex Bregman making the play up the middle, and I just remember them being in gold uniforms and I'm just like man that's that's one of the coolest things ever man and, and it's just something that history is, has shown us I mean Skip Burtman and Palmineri have done a great job in, in building this program and, and obviously it means something to wear the purple and gold and, and I'm really looking forward to it this spring.